I saw the throne of God appear in a cloud as I walked the beach of Lake Michigan outside of Ludington, Michigan. I looked up and saw a huge cloud which covered the city of Ludington. Just above the cloud I could see three steps as you are looking at here. I had an artist draw this for me. I was not allowed to record what I was viewing, but for your viewing pleasure I have had this created so that you can begin to appreciate the sign God showed me. I saw his eyes, his nose, his jaw, hands, and feet. I saw he was wearing a long garment like a choir robe. The yoke of it by his chest was square in shape with pleats at the shoulders. I could see each stitch that held the pleat in place and it was fitted to his wrist. I could see the zipper beginning at the th uh, neck of the garment go all the way to the floor and I could see each tooth in the garment. I could see the teeth in the zipper. I could also see his feet and hands as he sat on the throne. This is a similitude. It is a likeness of the real thing. In Webster's Dictionary, it is written, a likeness is a resemblance, a person or thing that is the like, match, or counterpart of another. Semblance or image, a likening or comparison, a parable or an allegory. Now that is what Webster had to say about a likeness, a similitude, and this is what I saw. God clearly showed me detail. I could see the eyes, the nose, the mouth. I could see the shoulders, and of course, about the shoulders, about in this area here, I could see that it was square, like a choir robe, and I could see each of the pleats and the stitches holding it. The zipper I could see had teeth all the way down to the skirt of the Lord's garment. I have never seen the Lord present to me in anything that was uncomely. He has never shown me more than the skin of his face and hands. In the book of Ezekiel, chapter 10, verse 1, it is written, Then I looked, and behold, in the firmament above the head of the cherubims, there appeared over them, as it were, a sapphire sown, as the appearance of the likeness of the throne of God. This, brothers and sisters, is what I present to you today, a likeness of the throne of God, which I was shown in 1998 in the city of Ludington. The whole cloud covered the city, and it was huge. So it remained there for a couple of hours, at least, that I just got to look and stare at what I saw. I thank God, but again, he is proving himself to be the Lord. Jesus Christ is Lord. He is Almighty. Amen. In the book of Ezekiel, chapter 10, verse 1, it is written, Then I looked, and behold, in the firmament that was above the head of the cherubims, there appeared over them, as it were, a sapphire stone, as the appearance of the likeness of a throne. Brothers and sisters, when the Lord shows me a sign, he always backs it up with his word. And this word confirms the fact that he will show us likenesses of certain things, resemblances of another thing. Jesus spoke to his people in parables so that they could convey an understanding about a given thing. Therefore, I presented this to you today, and I believe that it has helped you and also enriched your faith in the Lord. Jesus is coming soon, and Jesus is Lord. It was a pleasure to serve you.